Welcome back troops to the latest edition of Sam Watch Live. Today we have another six scale figure review from the militaries of Star Wars line. Uh, the Snow Trooper at long last. Uh, we finally have him in hand guys. The exclusive version. Uh, looking really really cool. Uh, I, I just have to say I was really taken back when, when I got him in the mail. Um, couldn't wait to get him. I think many of you remember about a month ago we reviewed the uh, E-Web Heavy Repeating Blaster and I think my biggest gripe could have been that we didn't have the uh, Imperial Snow Trooper. Uh, this is without a doubt uh, a, a huge fan favorite. I think many of us have been waiting a long, long time to get it. Uh, this limited edition of 1500, it, it was, you know, it, the, the Vintage blaster rifle just sealed the deal for me. I know I've, I've mentioned in the past sometimes Sideshow makes an exclusive and it's just not really too urgent to get it. But this one with the vintage blaster rifle, it was a slam dunk, had to have it. And uh, without further ado, troopers, we're going to crack into the nitty gritty and we're going to see what the Imperial Snow Trooper has to offer. And uh, we're going to dust off that E web cannon and see how it looks with the snow trooper and not a storm trooper. Come on troops, let's check it out. Okay troopers, as you see, uh, the snow trooper without question was worth the wait. Uh, they did a fantastic job uh, loading this guy up with all kinds of articulation features. Uh, very much like, in fact I should say instead of from head to toe, from head to flow, we can uh, point out um, I'm going to take them off the stand here just for one quick second to show you guys the, you know, the environment feature that they put right into the stand. That's pretty cool. I, I think that, you know, that's something that we collectors want. If they're going to continue to escalate the price of these figures, we want more options. And I think definitely having uh, something to make more hawk-like is, is quite awesome. Uh, another thing that, that, that I really like is the battle scoring that they did on the uh, shoulder pauldrons, the knee guard, the, the arm guards. It's, it's just incredible. They, they went and did just like the real deal. I'm going to show you one of the extra set of hands here for a second, but the dirt's going heavy into the cracks and then light everywhere else. Um, just, just like I would do on, on my sand trooper costume or, or anything else. Um, you'll see in the, the, the detail and paint work they did in the chest plate and right down in there it's it's just a great great job very accurate very much like the real deal i've had uh in my tour of duty over the years with the 501st legion uh, midwest garrison i've had to assist some of my fellow snow troopers and you'll see this has real clips just like the uh just like the backpack would have on a um you know the real snow trooper so i think they did a incredible job on that you turn them around there's a uh, great detail paint work there's a little arabesque going on on the survival backpack and you just see the uh the they use some of the those parts from the snow trooper the e11 and the detonator back here are, are from the uh are from the um storm trooper but you know they, they got to reuse some stuff just to cut costs but the we're going to start with one of the three set of hands real quick. This is the one that comes on in, inside the package. These are the hands that come with it. Um, you've got this set here that would probably benefit the, uh, the E-Web Heavy Repeating Blaster, but these seem to hold the blaster really, really well in addition to the, uh, the exclusive vintage blaster rifle which this was the thing that sealed the deal for me on this one troopers I, I think that if you see how he holds this thing here like he's just about to come through the door with Lord Vader and take some serious names um, look at that guys that is just awesome I think they just knocked it out of the park um, without question from from head to toe the 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 the, 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 the base the detonator the, the backpack I mean they just did it all um, one of our forum members pointed out he didn't necessarily like the squinting going on um, with the eyes, but I, I, you know, I don't know if I'm, I'm neither here nor there with that. I, I think the, the job they did on the, uh, the face shield where it actually looks like you've got somebody breathing under there in the, in the cold weather, um, I think it's really cool. And, and another thing, they, they were not wasteful at all. 
you know you got the best of both worlds here you got punch you in the face with this one and then you got the peace symbol here with these hands uh, and as I said before I'm gonna show you real quick I wanna grab the e-web and give you just a quick look at how the snow trooper looks with his companion accessory you know we waited all this time oh and real quick too let me touch on this because I really like this the uh, the, the hands they come out like here and they go right back in and they slide in they they, they did a little work to these they, they didn't always make them this way I don't know exactly how long they've been doing it like this but I, I really have to say these work really well and they seem to have a uh, great functionality um, quite impressed they pop right off there you know they, they they come off at either end so they don't break which I think that's a huge, huge plus when you're dropping $150 on an action figure. Um, let me grab the uh, eWeb's accessory real quick here. There we go. Let me grab them. Right there. It looks just like he's about to uh, take names on the Millennium Falcon, guys. I mean, Overall, what do you think? Is it, is it a piece worth uh, adding to your collection? Now that I actually have a snow trooper back here to a stormtrooper, I'd have to say I think so. So overall, troopers, I guess what do, it boils down to is are these two pieces worth $300? Um, the snow troopers limited to $1,500. That's a pretty low number. Uh, I really like it. I think they did the, the most amazing job from, from head to toe. Uh, just the, the, the weathering they did is, is better than I think I've seen on any other clone or stormtrooper or trooper that they've done uh, yet. Uh, they, they, they really knocked this one out of the park and impressed me. Um, in fact, I, I think that this by itself for $150 really wasn't worth $150 until I got this. Uh, by spending another hundred and fifty dollars so if you can appreciate or follow that that that's the conclusion I've come to uh, could you have the figure by itself absolutely you'd really enjoy the figure uh, by itself this would be pretty worthless without it because you know obviously this is the thing we would associate most with with the snow trooper uh, also you know uh, in fact our friends at sideshow uh, they've been Tremendous supporters of Sandtroopers.com. Sam watched live throughout the years. We thank them so very much. Uh, they sent us a uh, couple of the exclusive Snow Troopers. So uh, to 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 for our 2013 Battle Station functions, and I can assure you, one of those will be in our big raffle at C2E2. So come check us out there. Uh, make sure to like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter, and make sure to leave some positive comments in, in, in the box below. Uh, we, we appreciate hearing from you troopers. Uh, we're busy stacking up our munitions. we got a couple Tuscans, some Bakras. we got all kinds of stuff from Sideshow to give away, so stay tuned to Sandtroopers.com to, to learn how you might have a chance at one of those. Uh, but yeah, I must say, whether you bought it or whether you win it, you're really going to be in love with this thing. So until next time, I am Darth Spice. You are still so very, very glad you're not. United we find. The force is strong with sandtroopers.com. Indeed.